This is another episode of Beyond the Code, and today we have with us a tech journalist, Sham. Hi. So we'll be talking about. I mean, the Silicon Valley has always been infamous for burning tons of money, and we're seeing a similar pattern in terms of generative AI as well. Mm. I mean, I think in the last three to four weeks, I've the amount of hundred dollar, hundred million dollars, two hundred million dollars, four hundred million dollars funding. I think Hugging Face got the number just getting just keeps getting bigger. Yeah. And we, I mean, it, it's not just millions, right? It has gone to billions as well. You see, Anthropic getting billions of dollars. They got four billion dollars from Amazon, another two billion from Google as well, mm -hmm. right? Like, so the investments have been coming in from everywhere. Now that Indian companies are also getting investment, your Sarva AI got forty-one million dollars as well. So mm -hmm. investments are pouring in like every day. I've heard like one of those VCs. They wanted to invest in this company, and the company did not need any investments. I, I so I have a similar thing that I came across on LinkedIn that someone uh, created a fake profile of a generative AI startup as a CEO of that hmm. generative AI startup, and some VC reached out to him saying, "Okay, we are in, interested <laughs> yeah. in investing in you." So it's reached to a point that. Analysts have been seeing a similar pattern as NFTs and Web3. What mm -hmm. we saw, like up until like two years ago, everyone was just putting their money in everything that monkey-shaped <laughs> NFTs. Yeah. And uh, last year, when the entire Sam Bankman-Fried fiasco happened, uh, several billions went down in the market. Mm -hmm. And um, so, th a similar pattern of investment is being seen in terms of generative AI too. <laughs> that like people just keep putting in money. Without realizing the what the ROI, the in return is going to be from the technology. I think uh, where this is different is you. Uh, we are seeing uh, you know like interest from all over the globe, not just like with every other uh, thing, right? Like uh, say for your blockchains and everything, mm. it started from the West, it started from the US, but now we are seeing interest from all over the globe. Mm. India, France, UK, everyone wants in on this mm. whole new thing and. Uh, it has uh, use cases across uh, your healthcare and everything, right? Like hmm. because it is so important. I think the investments are somewhere. Yeah, different. so it is. I mean, we have seen Google's Alpha Fold. Hmm. Then there's the entire series of protein folding updates hmm. that we've seen. Hmm. So I mean, one can learn from this the spending scenario right now. So I think Microsoft. Yeah. While it is getting returns from some of its AI and generative AI products, mm. it's also seeing loss in terms of Copilot, which, mm. which is one of the flagship products. Mm. Yeah. So that is not that what should happen when these many billions are involved in on a certain technology. But I also think um, Microsoft is also making money, right? Like their Microsoft Azure OpenAI uh, product, right? Uh, they have what eighteen thousand odd enterprises subscribed to their services. Mm. So it is somewhere making money as well and. You have your Nvidia, which became a trillion-dollar company, basically selling shovels in this whole gold rush, right? Mm. Basically, right? That's yeah. what they did. I think it is overestimated, but somewhere there is also value. But the people who are putting in this money and mm. the people who are raising this, the um, the huge funds, I think they should be the one who keep in mind that they only do it to an extent, yeah. right? So, say for your example, your A16Zs, right? Mm. All these VCs, they have a history of doing this. Yeah. I mean. Hyping something up and mm. maybe taking an exit when it's on the top. Exactly. I think one of the venture capitals also said like uh, generative AI is something that was similar to Web three two years mm. ago. Like not a person couldn't even make a cup of chai without mentioning like Web three <laughs> or blockchain. So yeah. that is something similar that we've seen in terms of generative AI. True. I mean, but what I think is, it's still the beginning and it has it is very consequential and it is a very futuristic tech. However. Uh, I mean the pace at which these investments are coming in. I think that's kind of not justified because your returns are not going to come at that pace. Mm -hmm. So maybe let's just slow down and just use it when we need it, right? Companies need to make the investment. I mean, in a mm. year, it's grown from like mm. I think some around. It's become a 16 to 17 billion dollar yeah. industry. Yeah. So I mean, the investments are going to keep churning in, but it should be done. When it's justified, definitely. Okay. I mean, the biggest earners from this are your NVIDIA's. Like, it became a trillion-dollar company yeah. because of this thing. Hmm. However, I agree that it should. We should only raise money. I mean, these companies should take raise it on money. their own pace because it also has effects on your environment, right? Like, yeah, exactly. Of... The entire sustainability. That's one of the reasons that 
what um, a lot of open source lead, like uh, visionaries are saying mm. that it, moving forward we're going to be building smaller models mm. that are cheaper to make better for the environment mm. more sustainable re require less computational resource mm. and one of the major reasons for the funding the investments is for the computational resources yeah. Yeah. so if in future you're going to be making smaller models might as well raise a smaller amount definitely because you are going to need so much co uh, computational power you're going to build as much data centers right huh. and that needs a lot of your cooling um, infrastructure and whatnot and that requires a lot of energy i think now that you mentioned data centers that's a good note to end on yeah that should be another topic that we we'll discuss in an upcoming episode definitely surely.